Well, I hope you are aware by now that 2019 is Property Tribe's 10th anniversary, and to celebrate that, we are championing the concept of the smart landlord. And smart landlords are always looking for ways to become more efficient in their business. And joining me to discuss that is John Notley, CEO of Deposit Replacement uh, Zero Deposit. And John, um, first of all, what do you think of this whole concept of, of the smart landlord? Is that going to be the demographic and the profile of the landlord that thrives and survives in the challenges? Yeah, I think there are a lot of headwinds facing landlords from you know finding it harder to get tenants to more competition, more legislation coming in, you know, financial implications from some of the treasury's uh, changes. So, yeah, I think you know to survive in that, you're going to have to be pretty um, pretty smart. The, the really interesting thing about zero deposit is that the, 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 the journey most landlords will go on is, you know, often if the, the tenant has uh, raised the idea of zero deposit. Mm -hmm. And the, the natural starting point, because on the face of it, this is a product that improves affordability for tenants when they move into a property. Um, landlords will come and check out our product, uh, really wanting to understand it from the tenant's point of view. But when they start digging into the product and understanding the benefits to the landlord, mm -hmm. that's when they realise it's a really smart choice for them, mm -hmm. not just for the tenant. Mm -hmm. And let's talk about some of those benefits, yeah. because I think, well, the first one would be definitely to say that if a tenant doesn't have to front up a month's rent in advance, it, it stands to reason that they, landlords could attract a much bigger pool of prospective tenants into the property. Have you done any research to um, look into that? Yes, so we worked with one of our partner agents uh, a few months ago who was able to show uh, portal stats for properties advertised with zero deposit and properties advertised without zero deposit. And it was very clear that the properties advertised with deposit replacement zero deposit um, got a higher click-through rate and obviously you get a higher click-through rate you get more interest you get more leads you get more demand more demand you're more likely to rent the property mm -hmm. um, more quickly so and intuitively it makes sense but we're getting to the point now where we've actually got data to back that up mm. um, and you know it's no surprise that you know many of the partner agents who are in our distribution network are really pushing the fact that zero deposit um, is available on the property because it generates more leads mm. Indeed, and I think one thing that landlords are, you know, very much complaining about on property tribes is increasing regulation, mm. increasing compliance. And zero deposit is one of those rare products where there's actually less admin and red tape. Could you explain why? Yeah, so I guess the, the headline here is that zero deposit is not a cash deposit. Mm. So uh, we're not subject to the same rules that a cash deposit would be. Mm. And... You know, there are some benefits to that today. Uh, you know, when, I don't need to tell you, Vanessa, when you take a cash deposit, you have to register it with a mm -hmm. deposit replacement provider within a fixed period. You have to provide prescribed information. And if you don't do those things, you can leave yourself quite exposed and take on quite a lot of risk as a landlord. And, um, and a lot of landlords aren't aware of this. Mm. Um, and even those who are aware, some end up falling foul of it. Because zero deposit isn't a cash deposit, those rules don't apply. Mm -hmm. So we take care of distributing all of the product documents to the landlord, the, uh, the tenant, and the letting agent. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, past the registration process, the landlord can relax and we'll take care of that headache for them. Indeed, and the smart landlord also should be utilising online platforms because... Well, obviously, it makes everything more efficient. There's an audit trail. Um, and actually, tenants are of the demographic, the younger demographic, where they expect digital interaction with whatever they're you know, involved with. So again, good, smart choice for landlords, because everything that you do is, is online. That's right. Everything's online. We're integrated with some of the sort of leading payment um, providers. Uh, there's no reason why, you know, if everyone's lined up, someone can't get through the entire sort of quote and sale process within within a few minutes. Mm -hmm. um, it's really very simple, and that's not just at the the sales price, uh, the sales end, but it's also at the claims end. We're fully integrated with TDS, um, so once the claim is raised, uh, that is all pushed through electronically, and it's, there's no worrying about sort of admin unnecessary admin mm -hmm. as a result of it taking zero deposit. Mm -hmm. So what other features would you say um, of zero deposit really do uh, apply in the context of, of the smart landlord? So, well, I suppose, first of all, if you're going to accept a product instead of cash, mm -hmm. 
you need to make sure it gives you as much protection as possible. Yeah. And uh, with, with zero deposit, that was really our starting point, was to make sure the product was as protected as possible. So every guarantee is underwritten by Great Lakes Insurance SE. Uh, they're a subsidiary of Munich Re, who are the, one of the largest reinsurers uh, in the world. The product is fully regulated. Um, so that's not just about the way that we conduct ourselves and the way that the product is introduced to tenants, but it also means there are additional protections that are on offer to the landlord. So every guarantee is protected by the financial services compensation scheme and customers are also protected by the financial ombudsman service. So being regulated means that they've got that underwriting from a leading uh, reinsurer but it also means that they've got the additional protections that come as a result of FC, FCA regulation. Indeed, and that should give landlords a great deal of peace of mind. And of course, you know, this is a growing sector. We're seeing more and more new entrants into the sector, yeah. and it's really important, and Property Tribes really always promotes that landlords find their way to those uh, suppliers that do have the full raft of, of compliance and, and regulation around the product to make it safe for them to use it. Yes, and I think for us, you know, we're seeing some players coming into the market who aren't regulated um, you know I'm sure they're running a you know very professional operation but for us I think the start and end point was to make sure that customers knew they had the protections that come with an FCA regulated business and uh, you know especially with memories of 2006 to 2008 the protections of things like the financial services compensation scheme are essential if you're going to accept something instead of cash. Mm -hmm. So I guess um, just as we close out here, John, landlords, um, you know, they, they, they can get stuck in their ways. Um, they find products and services they like. They're not yeah. particularly motivated to look at other options. But I think, you know, really going back to what we said at the beginning, in this very challenging environment for landlords, um, those that do make the effort to check out new products and services, see where there are efficiencies, reduce admin, well, yes, it's, it's, it's smarter, but it also it makes for an easier landlord life in the end, doesn't it? Yeah, absolutely. And, you know, for any landlord who'd want to find out more, uh, they can visit zerodeposit.com yeah. uh, and our landlord section, and we spell out exactly the process, uh, you know, all of the protections that are in place. Mm -hmm. uh, they're able to view the product doc documentation, uh, you know, and read generally about the product there. You know, for mm -hmm. us, it's about making the process as easy as possible for landlords, but also for, for agents and tenants. Indeed. And we should just also point out that you are partnered with our traditional deposit protection scheme, TDS, who are going to be handling all your uh, uh, dispute resolution as well. So landlords can rest assured that at the back end of the tenancy, there is, you know, a good, uh, robust process in place for them there as well. Yeah, that's right. We've, I've already talked about the security and the protection that comes with both our underwriter and our regulated status. Mm -hmm. At the back end of the tenancy, landlords can be confident that there's a fair claims process. Uh, our unique partnership with TDS means that if there's any dispute between the tenant and the landlord, the evidence is sent to TDS. Mm -hmm. The same people who look at uh, evidence yeah. at the end of a cash deposit, and we pay the landlord based on TDS's findings, and we pay the landlord within two days. Yeah. Um, so there's no concerns about you know all the benefits of insurance and the safety, but the concerns around claims mm -hmm. because it's TDS who are looking at the evidence at the end of the tenancy. Well, that's fantastic. I know that John, you're really getting some good traction place um, in the market, and I think a lot of that comes from the credibility of the offering, um, the partners that you've chosen to work with, your background ex Zoopla, etc. So very exciting times for you, and I th can only see that kind of this whole topic is just going to gain more traction within the landlord communities. Yeah, I totally agree. We're growing at a, an incredibly rapid rate every month. We've got an amazing partnership network. We're delighted to come on board with Property Tribes, uh, hopefully add some value over yeah. the, ne the next few months as deposit replacement continues to grow. Indeed. Well, I think the only reason that would stop landlords using it is because they didn't fully understand it. And certainly, you know, when I first found out about it, I had a few misgivings. I've overcome those misgivings myself through understanding the product. So I think um, having your contribution as the CEO of the company to the Property Tribes community to help them learn about the product and understand it is, is, is a vital part of the process. And we're really grateful for your contribution to Property Tribes as well.
Likewise. Thank, Thank you. you so check out, we've got more Smart Landlord content coming throughout 2019. If you are watching this on YouTube, I would like to invite you to click across to propertytribes.com. That is where our discussions are hosted. And indeed, if you've got any questions about uh, zero deposit, how it works, how it benefits landlords, anything at all, then please just drop them on propertytribes.com. And John and his team are very, very happy to answer those questions, bring clarity to the proposition, because smart landlords want to know about these kind of products. Thank you, John. Thank you, Vanessa.